Okay, this eye here has chronic, you have chronic bowels here, okay? The bowels are the most pressing thing here. You have radar accelerates, very fine lines leaching out of the um, pupil. Indicates structural tunnels of waste, okay? This is affecting um, your brain, especially your brain section, okay? This is not a good, a good thing, so it needs to be clean. Here's the ascending colon, here's the transverse colon, here's the descending colon. And you can see that it's enlarged, the bowels are enlarged. So we need to cleanse it up. If you look closely, you have a malabsorption ring, that dark ring around the pupil indicates you're not absorbing nutrients properly due to mucal plaque in the small intestines. You have a thick, thick skin ring, indicates you're not sweating properly, the skin is not fun uh, performing properly, okay, as it should. It's because the skin is trying to take the burden from the kidneys. The skin is the third kidney, tries to take the burden from the kidneys, but because it can't do so properly, you have the skin ring, okay, it needs to be cleaned out. You see all that yellow, orange color, that's limb stagnation. Okay, but more importantly, there's also potential sulfur and candida. So I'll use an antimicrobial um, tincture as well with the fruit diet and the herbs. See right here, this is thyroid. You have you have chronic thyroid. The thyroid is getting very weak. Okay, that's why you have the, the skin ring as well. Because you're not sweating properly. The metabolism is not as high as it should be. So a weak thyroid. If you look closely here right here, that's the pituitary gland and the pineal gland. Pituitary gland is the gland that controls all the other endocrine glands. So it's important that it's in good working order. I'll use, I would use a pituitary glandula and a endocrine tincture. The pineal gland is what's much for sleep. If you don't fix it, you have sleep issues soon, okay? So it doesn't need to be addressed. The bowels need to be cleaned up for sure. You need a bowel cleanser, you need a bowel strength tincture as well. Right here is where the lower back is lo located, okay? And the blood is beside it right here, okay? Full of limb stagnation congestion. You should use the, uh, it's a kidney issue, okay? When you have lower back issues or congestion in the lower back, it usually first the kidney as well, and the blood as well, it's kidney issue. So kidneys are pressing. Right here is the uterus and vagina region. You can see heavy limb stagnation congestion. Right here is where the kidneys and adrenals are located. Okay, when the adrenals are weak, you're gonna have the nerve rings going around the eye. You see those rings going around around, those are nerve rings. In any case, a weak nervous system. Look at the, the there's also a, a line going around the bowels, okay? That's the autonomic nerve rings. Indicates that your nervous system is weak in the, in the digestive system, okay? So it needs to be uh, fixed. Use an adrenal tincture um, and a um, kidney and, and lymphatic tea to help you move the limb system, to help you get the kidneys filtered, to help the adrenals as well. So use an adrenal herbs as well, kidney tincture, and a lymphatic um, tincture as well to help you. For the um, uterus and vagina region, I would use a tincture called uh, reproductive F, a female reproductive tincture to help strengthen this region. Right here is where the uh, ovaries and uh, pancreas region is located. Pancreas is here, ovaries are here. Okay, you can see it's moving to the dark side, so you have congestion there. I would use the female reproductive formula there for the pancreas as well. I would use the liver and pancreas formula. Right here is the, the liver, okay, and the, and, and the gallbladder. Also very weak. The liver is the chemical factory in the body. You need to be in good working order. Gallbladder is what is used to um, uh, metabolize or break down fats. So you need to address this as well, okay? If you look closely around the eye, you see these um, dots here, brown spots here. Those are drug deposits, but also could be lymph nodes, swollen lymph nodes, because they're, they're all over the eye and they're like a rosary bead. Okay, so you need to address this. The lymph is getting stagnant. The lymph system, as you can see, the yellow and the, the color here, is lymph stagnation. This means the kidneys are not filtering. This means the adrenals are not working properly. It means the lymphatic system is getting stagnant, okay, like a river. Remember that the lymph system is what removes waste from your cells. If it can't move properly, it will back up, it will stagnate like this, it will thicken, and it will start um, the acids in it will affect organ tissue and glands. And this needs to be addressed quickly. Right, right here, this region right here, it's where the, um, the ear and mastoid region are located, okay? And this is important to know because the mastoid and medulla right here, this region and the cerebellum, is responsible for, the mastoid and medulla are responsible for balancing equilibrium dizziness. If you don't fix it, you get dizziness, dizzy spells, equilibrium issues and balancing issues. Cerebellum is the main hard drive of the brain. It's what sends message to the rest of the body to do its work. So you need it in good working order. I would use a neurological tincture and a circulation tincture to address this as well, okay? Um, you also, right here is um, the lower and upper lung region. You can see it's heavy limb stagnation and the, uh, the lymph nodes are getting stagnant. And right here is the thorax, ribcage, and chest region. Also heavy limb stagnation, congestion. Right here is where the breast is located. All is full of lymph. The lymph is your main problem here. It's thick lymph, uh, lymphatic system. Kidneys not filtering, adrenals not working properly. Bowels are congested. Brain is full of um, in the mucus as well. And the radar solaris hitting it as well. So this is going to take a bit of time to clear up. But um, you'll get better as you go along. Because this is, um, uh, I would imagine, a true brown eye, okay? Even though potentially it could be a blue eye. Because this yellow and brown color, it's not natural to the eye. It will change as you detox.